Shared Memory Objects in Multiprocessing Suppose I have a large in-memory NumPy array, I have a function func that takes in this giant array as input, together with some other parameters. Func with different parameters can be run in parallel. For example, If I use multiprocessing library, then that giant array will be copied for multiple times into different processes. Is there a way to let different processes share the same array? This array object is read-only and will never be modified. What's more complicated, if R is not an array, but an arbitrary Python object, is there a way to share it? Edited. I read the answer but I am still a bit confused. Since fork is copy on write, we should not invoke any additional cost when spawning new processes in Python multiprocessing library. But the following code suggests there is a huge overhead. Output, and by the way, the cost increases as the size of the array increases, so I suspect there is still overhead related to memory copying. Why is there such huge overhead, if we didn't copy the array? And what part does the shared memory save me? If you use an operating system that uses copy on write fork semantics, like any common Unix, then as long as you never alter your data structure it will be available to all child processes without taking up additional memory. You will not have to do anything special, except make absolutely sure you don't alter the object. The most efficient thing you can do for your problem would be to pack your array into an efficient array structure, using NumPy or array, place that in shared memory, wrap it with multiprocessing.array, and pass that to your functions. This answer shows how to do that. If you want a writable shared object, then you will need to wrap it with some kind of synchronization or locking. Multiprocessing provides two methods of doing this, one using shared memory, suitable for simple values, arrays, or C types, or a manager proxy, where one process holds the memory and a manager arbitrates access to it from other processes, even over a network. The manager approach can be used with arbitrary Python objects, but will be slower than the equivalent using shared memory because the objects need to be serialized slash deserialized and sent between processes. There are a wealth of parallel processing libraries and approaches available in Python. Multiprocessing is an excellent and well-rounded library, but if you have special needs perhaps one of the other approaches may be better. This is the intended use case for Ray, which is a library for parallel and distributed Python. Under the hood, it serializes objects using the Apache Arrow data layout, which is a zero copy format and stores them in a shared memory object store so they can be accessed by multiple processes without creating copies. The code would look like the following. If you don't call array.put then the array will still be stored in shared memory, but that will be done once per invocation of func, which is not what you want. Note that this will work not only for arrays but also for objects that contain arrays, for example, dictionaries mapping into arrays as below. You can compare the performance of serialization in Ray vs Pickle by running the following in IPython.
Serialization with Ray is only slightly faster than Pickle, but deserialization is 1000x faster because of the use of shared memory. This number will of course depend on the object. See the Ray documentation. You can read more about fast serialization using Ray and Arrow. Note I'm one of the Ray developers. I ran into the same problem and wrote a little shared memory utility class to work around it. I'm using multiprocessing.rare, lock free, and also the access to the arrays is not synchronized at all, lock free, be careful not to shoot your own feet. With the solution I get speed ups by a factor of approx 3 on a quad core i7. Here's the code. Feel free to use and improve it, and please report back any bugs. Like Robert Nishihara mentioned, Apache Arrow makes this easy, specifically with the Plasma in Memory Object Store, which is what Ray is built on. I made Brain Plasma specifically for this reason, fast loading and reloading of big objects in a Flask app. It's a shared memory object namespace for Apache Arrow serializable objects, including pickled byte strings generated by pickle.dumps.dot. The key difference with Apache Ray and Plasma, is that it keeps track of object it's for you. Any processes or threads or programs that are running on locally can share the variables values by calling the name from any brain object. <laughs> 